I phoned up to get the results and was told quite casually over the phone, oh yes, you have diabetes. Didn't really quite know what to say or what to do. You're sort of left to your own devices, really. Guilty and ashamed, humiliated, and as if you've got something that you could have prevented and done something about it. It's the general embarrassment and stigma. Nobody really likes to talk about it. I feel that I was quite young when I was diagnosed. I think that's partially a genetic thing. I want to prevent the idea of complications, to do something to just reverse it really. I know that it can be reversed. My family would be delighted if I could get to a diabetes free point. I'm not sure they believe at the moment that I could do that, but I think they would be delighted. Do you want to come and take part in this? And do you want to take part in this? No. <laughs> I work for a local green energy company. I've been there for seven and a half years. You'll have a portal to log in to book the appointments. The biggest obstacle to good health is a lack of time. If I had more time, I could invest that time in focusing on good health. I'm really looking forward to it. I really am. At the beginning, I'm just going to see how the next seven days goes. My last HbA1c was 62, and I need to get that under 46. Yeah, looking forward to the results. I think it's good that you have this entire replacement, so you haven't got to worry about preparing stuff for yourself. The dietitian was saying, you know, if you get really hungry when you're in work, have sort of half a one in the morning then have your lunch and then have maybe the other half, but that counts as an, a meal to be counted within the four throughout the day. Somebody's birthday today, so this is um, birthday treats in the office. In my head, I can't have like a glass of wine or anything nice like that till November, which seems like a long way away. But if I can reach November and say that I haven't got type two anymore, then that will be the best outcome. It's been a long, week heading home i have some concerns about what my guys are going to think and do about this new plan that i'm on whether they'll take it seriously not such a pretty picture today um feeling tired hungry annoyed one of those days where when i came in everybody was asking me what feels like really ridiculous questions Got a weigh in tonight 14 stone four and when you get home and people you know going on about pizzas and this and that yeah not very good i had to to message the coach this afternoon because i was on the verge of cracking i like the fact that I can get support from Karen at Ogiva, the dietitian, because you can ask all kinds of questions. Day 12, I need to pop into our surgery and give the doctors the sort of list of blood pressure readings that I've been taking. Um, but now I've got this app, they are handily on there. We're involved in lots of things in the local area too. I'm heavily involved in our local rugby club, which is Stride Rugby. I think it first started when I was asked to help in the kitchen one Sunday. You know, Aidan had come here for a bit of a tryout. People that I know, some of my friends, particularly those at the rugby club, are giving me a lot of support with this, and that's really appreciated. <laughs> you just left. Rugby's a, it's a whole family thing, and um, we call it rugby family, don't we? And this sort of applies to friends we know at other rugby clubs as well. So the first couple of weeks were, well, a challenge. It's really convenient in that you have these shakes that you just, you know, there's no sort of querying what you're going to have. This is my dedicated cup to the new plan. 
Saturday morning, day 16. Just having this vanilla shake this morning. Adding this week's weight loss onto my Insta. I find it quite helpful when people are giving me encouraging comments. Yesterday was weigh day. Add another three pounds gone, so eight pounds. Having attempted to lose weight before, never quite got to losing a whole entire stone, so that was a massive breakthrough moment for me, very happy. To reverse this is our main goal, main aim, mm. and hopefully for you know, a healthier future. A healthier future. Yeah. Oh. <laughs>